One of our surveyors had an interesting discovery today while he was surveying a tree bed semi-detached house in Loud. The house was built in the year 2000, which means it's fully subjected to the 1993 building regulations. And these regulations state that a habitable room, which includes bedrooms, must be at least 7.1 meters squared. But one of the bedrooms in the house was 6.4 meters squared. So how is the house ever sold as a tree bedroom? Well, when the house was originally built, the bedroom was larger than 7.1 square meters, and so was compliant with building regulations. But while they were having the attic converted 10 years ago, they moved the wall of the bedroom so that they could fit the attic stairs in place, reducing the size of the bedroom to 6.4 square meters. So in a nutshell, this means that it's no longer a three bed house, it's a two bed house. You might say, what difference does that make? I can still fit a single bed in the room. And that might be the case, but if this person was ever to resell the house in future, a diligent estate agent might point out that it's only a two bed house and so they may only be able to price it that way for the market. It also means that while the solicitor is trying to qualify the title, if the certificate of compliance with building regulations for the attic conversion and the associated works does not mention a reduction in room size, there might be some red flags raised. This is just another example of why it's vital that you do as much due diligence as possible before you sign those contracts and part of that is hiring a surveyor who knows what to look out for.